everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be going through my second completed sketchbook. This sketchbook started out as a travel journal, but after actually traveling, I wanted to continue the sketchbook, so I turned it into a regular sketchbook. As you can see in the beginning, there were many errors. I found out that I'm very bad at drawing on the spot with like time constraints. So I just leisured. I took inspirations from the things around me and then created. I'm just like, I was so inspired, you know? That's my son. Hi. That's my son. What's up, Papa? For the beginning of the sketchbook, I was in Hawaii visiting my mom. A lot happened then. I really settled into these ideas of mixing things with plants that typically wouldn't be mixed with plants. And I had a lot of fun with this theme. Needless to say, I really built this up as my comfort zone. Had a lot of fun with the small details. And I miss making work like this, to be honest. <laughs> it was like, it's just comfortable. I don't want it. What the heck? Stop, other things are hard. Trying new things is so hard. I'm tired, but you know what? I am living and I'm growing and I'm learning and that's beautiful. And I even animated a little bit. Here's a little animation of a pill bottle I drew. That was fun. I feel like this is where I really came into my own a little bit and that was cool. This was back when I drew every single day for <laughs> months and i kind of killed it honestly i don't look back at this art and cringe you know i'm pretty happy with it still to this day these next three illustrations all were made during a hard times it's like a progression not gonna go into too many details but sad toaster trapped light bulb love washing machine what more can i say <laughs> these flower heads oh my goodness some of my most liked work on instagram but bodies are so hard, I can't. Drawing bodies is so difficult. I practiced my coloring so intensely in the beginning of the sketchbook, <laughs> which I can say, honestly, I can feel myself getting better at coloring. Creating color palettes is getting easier for me and that is not something I could say four months ago and that is a great feeling. Right here, I did some colored pencil work and failed. I'm so bad at colored pencils still. This is a gouache painting that I'm in love with. That's, that's it. Back to the tech theme. Love me some tech. Pay no attention to the man on the left. I really messed up his face. Here's me trying to be Lee Alexin again. She just lays colors down so intentionally. I just want to give it a try every time I see it happen. This page I love. I This is probably my favorite page, or well, one of my favorite pages. I think the two colors go perfectly together and I like the style. These next few pages are just fun. Just me having a good time, to be honest. <laughs> I miss alcohol markers. They look so good here. I'm practicing my portraits, yes! Not the best at it, but as long as I keep practicing, then I can't be too angry. I love these. These are one of my other favorites from the sketchbook. I feel like the biggest change from the beginning of my sketchbook to the end of my sketchbook is the fact that in the beginning, I really played it safe. Towards the end, I feel like I actually tried experimenting more and being more loose with my sketchbook. And yeah, maybe that's not gonna get you the most amount of likes on Instagram, but I feel like I'm improving faster than I was back then, and that's a really great feeling. This page is my ultimate favorite page. It has everything. I stepped out of my comfort zone. I drew a person and I had fun. These last two pages, I actually finished in another video, so if you wanna check that out, the link will be in the description. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe, and join me for the next videos to come. Have a good day, bye.